Technology is pl playing a bigger and bigger and bigger role in uh, farming. A truly green greenhouse in Southern California can grow 20 times as much food as a regular acre. This is five acres of solar panels that uh, move with the sun to maximize the uh, the efficiency of the panel. It generates its own energy and never wastes a drop of water. This is where all the irrigation water, all the roof water, rain water, condensation water all collects. You can see all the algae on top of it. They have an extensive filtration system for the algae. The solids get filtered out first through multimedia filtration. It goes into a million gallon tank for storage. And then further down there, you'll see an ultra filtration plant that takes all the particles out. Not only do they filter the water, they chill it. When we strip the heat out of that water, we take it and we store it in million gallon water tanks and use it to heat the greenhouse. When you walk in here, you can really feel the yeah. pressurization. Inside the greenhouses, they grow nine different types of tomatoes and cucumbers year-round with little impact on the environment. This greenhouse has uh, almost no roof vents and it pulls the air in through the sidewalls through fans that blow it into the greenhouse through big tubes for a very consistent distribution. Computers help with fans, humidity and CL2. The closed environment means more hybrids and minimal pesticides. Bees pollinate the plants. This is a tomato plant. It's grown in a block. It's grafted, so it lasts a lot longer. It's got much stronger root system. And the roots are actually growing here in coconut fiber. From flowers to picking, the tomatoes take just eight weeks compared to 12 to 16 weeks the old-fashioned way. For Forecast Earth, I'm Lisa Love.